Hey gamers, are you tired of hitting that pause button on your game just so you can cook a meal? Well, today we have the ultimate solution for you. Welcome to the Esports Hector YouTube channel where we will show you the easy appliances around your house that can help you cook a delicious meal without missing a single frag. Let's check them out. We've all been there. You're in the heat of battle and suddenly your stomach starts growling but you don't wanna leave your teammates hanging. What do you do? The problem is you can't afford to step away from your game for too long. So you think to yourself, cooking a meal seems impossible, right? Well, fear not fellow gamers. We've got some fantastic solutions that will make cooking a breeze without compromising your gaming experience. First up is the Instant Pot. I'm using the Ninja Foodi, and the reason why I like the Ninja Foodi is just because of the utility that it provides. I can use it as an Instant Pot or pressure cooker. Again, those words or those terms are synonymous with each other. I can saute, I can air fry. It gives me endless options. So I'm just gonna take the air fry basket out, put the top for this on. I would turn it on. Okay, I would set it to the pressure cooking setting, which would be over here, and then I can just set the time. It's sealed and it's ready to go. What it'll do here is by putting all the ingredients in, it'll cook everything in a fraction of the time, giving you a delicious meal without having to put any effort. And what that means is you can get back to your gaming session. Next up, we have the air fryer. Again, I am using the Ninja Foodi, but you don't have to. If you already have an air fryer in your house, by all means, go ahead and use that. I'm just using this because of the utility that it provides. It's a secret weapon for creating crispy, delicious snacks, as well as meals. You can also pop in some fries, chicken wings, or even pizza rolls, and it'll be ready right before your next respawn. Very easy. In this case, I'm just opening it up. In the first segment, you saw me take out the basket, but I'm leaving the basket in this time because everything will just drip right out of it, all the grease and whatnot. So it leaves it pretty, uh, it still leaves it pretty tender, pretty juicy in terms of like the food. It doesn't dry it out. And it actually cooks it, I would say a little bit quicker just because it's a much smaller space. You just close it. Obviously this should be always be plugged in. Press the power button, air fry feature, and then you set the time and you set the temperature, whether it's high or low. What we have next here is our microwave. Don't underestimate the power of the trusty microwave. Again, my microwave is just hanging up on a wall, but some people may have it on a counter or like a butcher block of some sort. The microwave is perfect for reheating leftovers is my favorite, making microwavable meals and heating up that cold cup of coffee you forgot during your gaming session. Again, a lot of that may take a minute and a half, two minutes. If it's something that's frozen, it may take closer to, you know, three to five, maybe even up to six minutes. But once it's done, now you can get right into having that meal as you wait to queue up into your next match. Here's another gaming friendly appliance, the toaster oven. It's perfect for quick, even heating and toasting. You can make a nice, you know, French bread pizza, sandwich, or crispy garlic bread in no time. What I personally like about it as well is again, I can use this to recreate some leftovers or reheat leftovers and it takes very little time because it's such a small space as opposed to using an oven, which I'm not saying don't use one, but if you don't have a toaster oven, a normal oven on your stove would suffice just perfectly fine as well. For all you caffeine addicts, myself included, a coffee maker with a timer is a must have. Especially when I'm coaching clients first thing in the morning, I don't wanna be getting out of bed just to get my coffee ready. I set it up the night before, turn it on, set the alarm, and it'll automatically do it for me without having to move a finger first thing in the morning. Set it up before your gaming session, 
and your fresh cup of coffee will be ready when you need that extra boost of energy. Let's not forget about our handy dandy blender. Of course, this is by Ninja. Our products are not sponsored by Ninja in this video. My wife and I just agree with buying their products because of the simplicity and what we, you know, the features that we enjoy about them all. With our blender, we can whip up nutritious smoothies or protein shakes in seconds. That right there is gonna keep your energy levels high during your gaming sessions. Last but not least, everyone, we have the slow cooker. It's your ally for a hearty meal with minimal effort. The beauty in this is just tossing your ingredients in the morning, and by the time you're ready to take a break, a savory stew or a tender meat dish could be waiting for you. Again, I have my Ninja Foodie because it also acts as a slow cooker, but this is typically what you'll find over here with my right hand uh, as a slow cooker. It's a little bit wider. What we also like using it for is prepping the night before using some sort of cling wrap around the bowl. So in this case, the bowl just comes apart or comes out, close it up or seal it, put it in the fridge overnight. And then in the morning when we wake up, we may even set a really early alarm just to get up, put it in and just run it. So that way by like lunch or even dinner, it's ready to go. Some ingredients or some recipes may tell you to put it on high for a very short period of time. But personally, if you have that extra time and it's already prepped, I would put it on low and let it go for six to eight, maybe even 10 hours. That meat, if you, especially if you do a lot of chicken, I do a lot of chicken in the slow cooker, it's pull apart. So you could pretty much make pulled chicken, pulled meat. I've done pulled pork with it. We've done mac and cheese in the slow cooker. So the options truly are endless for what you can be able to do with this. And there you have it gamers. With these easy appliances in your arsenal, you can cook delicious meals and satisfy your hunger without ever leaving your game. So happy gaming and happy cooking. And we'll see you in the next queue. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to the Esports Hector YouTube channel and click on the notification bell so that way you won't miss any of the future gaming and cooking tips. As always, everyone, stay healthy and game on.